The most powerful feature in Notebook LM isn't actually in Notebook LM. Let me explain. So to clarify, you're still manually typing in your prompts in a Notebook LM like this. You're really only using about 10% of its actual power. So if you haven't played around with Notebook LM much, it is an awesome tool for not only storing tremendous amounts of data, information, YouTube videos, PDFs, PNGs, you name it, but also interacting with that content in pretty much any format you want. So basically, you know, here as an example, I have like 300 YouTube videos from a, a podcast or a series I really like, and I can literally just type in, you know, questions as they come to me into the prompt engine here, or use the self prompting guides down below to ask questions. But if you're familiar with this tool, it is as awesome as that is, it is also a limiting factor because you're limited to about 500 characters in your prompt. So you can only ask questions that, you know, are up to that limit. You can't really get into details on, I want this type of tone. I want you to answer all of these questions. I want you to include X, Y, and Z. The workaround for that is actually this Reddit thread is on this Reddit thread I came across yesterday where someone had this exact same thought on query or prompting length. And there's some really good takeaways in here. This person realized that they could only put in almost 2000 characters before they hit an error. But the real meat of it is down here. For anyone reading this in the future, just put your prompt in a document called Notebook LM Task and then instruct it to use that document as its prompt. I've assigned you a task in the document Notebook LM Task. Please review this document first and then complete the task within, within it using all other documents. So in less nerdy speak, basically what this means is you can, in a, in a Google Doc, you can plug in how like intricate, detailed, just however elaborate of a prompt you want or instructions, and then feed it back into Notebook LM like I did here. And as long as you're titling it Notebook LM task, you can literally prompt, I have assigned you a task in the document, and it will use that to gather its information from before it goes through and sources what you're asking from all of these other sources right? Super, super creative and such an, a powerful workflow because you're basically bypassing the limit of that 500 character mark. And you're able to get as detailed as you want in your Google doc. And then you're able to get just such more powerful answers back in Notebook LM. I'm constantly blown away by this tool. It is so helpful for so many different things, but it's just a tool. If you're interested in basically picking up more best practices like this, make sure to follow along as we're diving in a little bit deeper. Thanks for watching. Bye.